at least you get to be something. Women get to be nothing. Women aren't supposed to be anything. They're women. My father taught me to believe in the goodness of mankind, not ignorance and superstition. To defend the weak and those unable to defend themselves. To judge people, not by what others might say about them, but by their own deeds. My father would have chosen the valiant path, no matter how difficult the journey. Brilliant. Why do I have to be the bad one? <laughs> You're more believable. I don't want to be the bad one. Only because you don't want her to dislike you. That's true. That's selfish. That's true. Say goodbye, Humphrey. What if he is telling the truth? What if it rains emeralds? Certain things in life you need not question, dear sister. I never heard her complain about anything. Mm. Well, then she wouldn't have liked me very much. She would have liked you more than anyone. It was courage she admired most in people, I think, because she felt she had so little herself. You are the woman she wanted to be, Eleanor. What am I going to do? Find the courage to do what you have to do. Brother! What's this? Surely you haven't forgotten it's the eldest who carries the banner. Oh, you've carried it too long and too well for me to take it now. It doesn't matter. You're home. I don't want to take it. Then you reject the system in which our lives are governed. Everything we live by and believe in. I'll carry it, but I won't like it. I never said I liked it. Haven't we met somewhere? I don't think so. Why not? I don't know. Maybe you're like the other knights. You only have eyes for your horse. <laughs> Actually, my horse is very broad-minded. It doesn't mind my wandering eye. Guess who? And for every wrong answer, I win a kiss. King Edward. Wrong, that's one kiss. Uh, the Pope. Two. The bravest and most handsome man in all of England. You peaked. Then explain it to me. Because a man who used to play with me as a child, who sat up with me the night my mother died, is about to die himself, and I still don't know why. Richard, please go. I'm out of words. Father! Do as I say! Tell them I'll be there presently. It could have been anyone who ran to Lady Lambert's aid that night. This time it was Sherwood. The next time it could be Armas or Cedric. Or me. When innocence no longer matters, none of us are safe. Isn't it just like a woman to be late? Eleanor's rarely late. That's only because she's not really like an ordinary woman. Your perception of the female gender is truly profound, brother. So true. You're not doing as I said. Pray for relief from pain. Heavenly Father, I pray relief from heavy-handed friars. Here. Thank you, Father. You're most kind.